Hey guys, welcome to Rising Vibrations. This is a soul energy message for the sign of Taurus. There is no timestamp on this video. Whenever you find it is when you need to find it. We're trying to take time out of the some of the readings. This is for Taurus elemental sign and energy, sun, moon, rising, as well as Venus. So we're looking at if you are Taurus and you feel like life is really messed up right now and you don't know why. We're looking at from a karmic and on a soul energetic level, what are some of the issues that a Taurus may be trying to deal with that are making you feel really off, like life isn't going your way, but you're not sure why, and it's just something off, and you're trying to figure it out. We're also going to look at what you can potentially do or what you need to know about this period that might aid you in riding the karma or riding this karmic wave. And finally, we're going to look at some relationship issues that could be coming up, whether you're dealing with an ex or in a long-term partnership where you're having some problems and you can't quite pinpoint the reasons why. So this is for Taurus, Elemental Sign and Energies. We have Major Arcana, the Warrior. So this is an overall combative energy that's coming through. Like you feel like you have something to prove. And for some time, you feel like in life you have something to prove. That you, maybe in your life up until now, you have felt like you have to fight and win every battle. And... Perhaps you're at a point now where you really don't want to fight anymore. You're not interested in fighting anymore. But you're not sure how to put down that sword either. Because it's all you've ever known and it's all you've ever done. Perhaps you've been in a situation where you've really had to fight to survive. You're a Taurus elemental sign and energetic soul in the, in the sign of Taurus. And you have had to fight for everything you have, your whole life. And perhaps you've reached a place where you no longer need to fight, but the fight's still in you. This combative energy is still in you. And you don't know how to get away with it or get away from it. And you feel like it is perhaps negatively impacting your life. You can see something's wrong here, but you don't know how to bridge it. You don't know how to stop it. It You feel like it's a part of who you are. That's what's coming out in this major arcana, the warrior here. It's a very Mars, uh, Aries energy. Some tourists may also be thinking about the casualties that they've left behind, the people that they've hurt. I feel in some respects it has to do with children as well. Perhaps feeling like, um, especially for tourist males, that they haven't necessarily taken care of their children or partners or former partners the way they should have. And struggling a bit with this karmic energy right now. Again, this is for Taurus elemental sign. This is a soul energy message for Taurus. There's no time stamp on it, but I'm recording this on September 14, 2018. When you find these videos, when you need to find it, whether you're a Taurus or not. We have the Queen of Cups around what you need to know, what you can do, like a key to the situation. So this is almost saying, make love, not war. Or it's all about love. The contrast of the warrior, the god of war, and the queen in some ways of love with this queen of cups. How do you find that balance? 
how much do you need to win? How much do you feel that you need to always win? What inside of you is causing this? How easy it could be just to let some things go. What a weight would be lifted from you. If you focused a bit more on an energetic level of even forgiveness, or just letting things go again. If you've had if you've had that big fight or battle, how can you imagine it differently that you feel like you could put yourself in a position that you could just let it go, that it's not really that important, even if it is something amazingly important. Now I'm not talking about issues that deal heavily with money or with uh, legal matters where you really have to fight for legal reasons for, for, for work matters or things like this, tribunals or anything. But even if you are in that situation, what can you do from an energetic standpoint to project more love onto yourself or even onto your enemies? We're getting a little bit biblical here about loving your enemies, but that's really what's coming through in this soul energetic message for the Taurus elemental sign, sun, moon rising, as well as Venus. You will gain more. I know it seems counterintuitive, but that's the message that's coming through. Instead of taking on that argument, how hard would it be to back down, to offer peace, to offer peace or token of peace? What would be your token of peace? This is, a, this is what's coming through for Taurus. We have the King of Wands, which is coming very close again to the warrior. But it's very hard for Taurus because, again, if that's all you've ever known, you know, everybody's background is different. You never know when someone's dealing with traumatic issues from their childhood, uh, challenges that they've had where they, they have wounds that are easily open or that have never closed and they're trying to protect themselves. And it's worked for them so far, for the tourists. It's worked. It's been very effective. Even in their career for financial matters, but also for emotional and psychological matters. It's been effective in protecting them to a certain extent. But maybe Taurus, it's time to loosen up on this energy. This is the message that's coming through. It might be helpful for you to loosen up a bit on the energy. If you feel like life isn't going your way, if you feel like things are really stressful and you don't know why and something's off, it might be time for you to address this issue in some way. Doesn't mean you have to do it all at once. Major Arcana of the Tower. It's probably time for you to address this. And I feel like when you're finding this video, it's a breaking point. It's a, it's a turning point where you have an opportunity, perhaps at this point in your life, to really put down the sword and choose a solution that is less warlike and less combative and less confrontational than a solution that is more aggressive and destructive. Destructive with the tower, Major Arcana. And with this action of really giving a token of peace or some measure of peace can be a catalyst for a positive tower event or breakthrough versus a negative tower event or breakdown or breakup. The message is coming very clear for the Taurus elemental sign and energy, sun, moon rising, as well as Venus. We're going to pull three more to see if anything else comes up in terms of confirmation. Look at that. It's about balancing that dark and light energy, the shadow side, as well for the Taurus elemental sign and energy when you find this video. We have Major Arcana Temperance, 
it's time to find that balance. When you find this video, it might be the very time that you need to hear this message. Sometimes you can't push things too far. And if you would have just stopped just at the right point, it would have been more beneficial for you. I feel like it's that time right now. Look at that, Ace of Cups. It's that time you can find more benefit in your life right now towards your soul energetic message. You can find more benefit in your life right now by offering tokens of peace and love versus tokens of war and combat. Very clear message for Taurus. I'm very pleased about how this soul energetic message is coming through. It's much more clear than it was for Aries. Oh, you guys, wonderful. We have the we have the ace now, the ace of coins, the ace of pentacles. Look at this, guys. Please give it a consideration. I'm just here to tell you the messages that come through. Please look for this versus this, the tower, the warrior, major arcana, both, and the knight of wands. Take that positive energy. Take that positive talent in the knight of wands and fight for something that's really worth your time and energy. Versus fighting for things that are just going to take up your time and energy and leave you a negative result. What battles are worth fighting? Only you know that. But that's the message that's coming through for Taurus Elemental Sign and Energy. This is your soul energetic reading. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll see. Maybe I'll get more messages. We'll see how it goes. Take care, guys. Bye.